and welcome back to Simply Fatima. I'm so excited that you're back for another video. Today's video is super, super exciting because I was tagged to do another tag video. How awesome is that? I'm super, super, super excited about that. Before we get into the video, where are my manners? If you're an OD but a goodie, welcome back. And if you are new, welcome to Simply Fatima where we talk about all things luxury and luxury handbags. If you have not already hit that subscribe button, what are you waiting for? We have so much fun over here and we are, are a, a positive family. So just go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also give this video a thumbs up and also turn on your bell notifications so that you'll never miss an upload from me. Also follow me on Instagram at underscore simply Fatima underscore loves luxury so that we can connect and you can just show your girl some love. And that just gives me another platform to connect with each and every one of you guys because I love connecting with you all here and I would love to connect with you all there also don't forget that I am doing a 1,000 subscriber giveaway one lucky winner will be able to win the tote bag by Marc Jacobs another lucky winner will be able to win a pair of Gucci sunglasses so if you're interested in this giveaway please make sure to check the description box down below for all the entry details so without further ado let's get right into this video so this video today is is actually a tag that was created by a fellow YouTuber here who is also my friend. Her name is Shani Cole. Hey girl. And she tagged me and a lot of other awesome content creators here on YouTube called hashtag I love you the most tag. And so basically in this tag, you're taking a handbag that you absolutely love the most. It could be a designer handbag. It could be a non-designer handbag. It could be old. It could be new. It could be something that's already in your closet or in your collection, or it's something that you've given away, but you still love that handbag. So I'm going to try not to keep you guys super, super long because I feel like all of my bags are sentimental and they all mean something special to me. But I have one particular bag that absolutely means the most to me. And um, I'm really, really excited to share and share the background story behind this handbag. And so, yes, thank you, Shani Cole, for um, tagging me. I'm going to leave her original video in the description box down below. And I'm going to also leave her um, channel information in the description description box down below so that you guys can check out her channel and show her some love all right so the bag that I absolutely love the most and you can just see the excitement in my face and my voice and how eager I am to share this with you is literally my Louis Vuitton Speedy 30 this bag is the bag I absolutely love the most. Not only is it Louis Vuitton, not only is it a Speedy 30 because Speedy 30s hold a lot and it's a great bag, it's because it is my first ever luxury brand handbag that I have ever received. In my previous videos, like my Louis Vuitton monogram collection, my Louis Vuitton Speedy collection, and my Louis Vuitton handbag collection all together, you've known I talked about this bag and say that this is the bag that I got for my 16th birthday, but you guys really don't know how it came about or like the background story on how I got this handbag. Yes, I got this handbag at such a very young age and um, my parents gifted me this bag. Growing up, I've never been like a huge fashionista type of person, but I know I love handbags and heels. Absolutely love them. Growing up, especially like when you're a teenager and you're trying to define who you are as an individual and trying to just be that individual you know that you can be. I just know for myself, handbags and heels were it for me. Now, now, me getting into the designer world was a far stretch. Like I had a mentor, well I would call my mentor, she was actually um, the person who was over the youth dance group at my church and I was a part of the youth dance team at my church. And so this particular individual, she had a Louis Vuitton Speedy. I think hers was a Speedy 35 because hers was a little bit bigger than mine. But I absolutely loved hers. Like hers was literally this bag. When I had seen hers, it had patinaed like this. Hers had to have been the 35. She kept everything inside of it. And the way she like paired her Speedy with her outfits, I was like, I love that. And I am going to be just that. I'm going to get a Louis Vuitton monogram speedy and I am going to be able to look put together and very sophisticated 
just like how she was so I just knew I wanted that I wanted to look put together I wanted to wear my nice outfits with my heels with a Louis Vuitton handbag and I would tell my mom I'll be like hey mom I really like this handbag but it wasn't to the point where I was just like ma I really like this handbag I need this handbag ma I really want this handbag like I wasn't doing the most about it I would just like hint out or like if we went to the mall and we passed by the Louis Vuitton store I'll be like oh miss so-and-so has that handbag and you know like she carries it with pride and I want to be able to like look and dress and feel as like empowered and womanly as she carried herself so it was just like I would bring it up in passing conversation and so so my 16th birthday was like coming around and my mom came up to me and she was like do you want a sweet 16 party and invite a couple of your friends out you guys you guys go out to dinner and maybe come back to the house and just do some things and just hang out and chill or do you want to go on a trip and I could have gone with the like sweet 16 dinner and hanging out with friends and all that but I was just like a trip sounds really really fun so my mom was giving me like a list of places and then one day she was just like well would New York be fun to go to as a 16 year old and I was like New York is perfect I had never been to New York like I was in like my whole America's Next Top Model phase because at that time I really could like at that time America's Next Top Model would always come on WE TV <laughs> <laughs> was it we tip no come on MTV on Saturdays and literally run from like 8 a.m. up until 5 p.m. that afternoon um, and I would just sit and watch it and I would see these girls like photo shoots in New York and just like challenges throughout the city and New York for me was it so when my mom came to me and said that I was like yes let's go to New York for my sweet 16 it was just me my mom my dad and my sister and we went I know that because I went to New York for my birthday that they wanted to do a little extra for me and so we toured the Macy's um store in New York and we're walking up and down the fashion district and my mom was just like I know recently you've really been talking about this Louis Vuitton handbag you know your grades are good you're a good girl you know you don't cause any trouble you doesn't you don't cause any trouble with your teachers you've been humble like do you want to get your Louis Vuitton bag and I was like I like right now I am shaking just thinking about it because my parents didn't have to like say that let alone take me on this trip so I'm gonna be forever grateful for that I'm gonna be my parents mean so much to me and for them to come out of their way to take me on this trip to New York let alone buy me my first designer handbag keep in mind this is about like almost 10 years ago <laughs> it was this is like almost 10 years ago basically 10 years ago so of course the Louis Vuitton prices back then are different from how they are now because my parents totally did not pay a thousand dollars for this handbag they probably paid a good 700 800 at most um for this handbag but anyway my my mom was just like yeah me and my dad we wanted to surprise or uh, me and your dad wanted to surprise you with this Louis Vuitton handbag that you've been like you know casually throwing out there saying that you want and I was just like where are the cameras at you got to be kidding me like what and so like we went into the store we went into the store and like y'all I was literally in heaven like literally in heaven I'm just like I'm surrounded by all these handbags like I didn't want to touch anything because I'm like all of this stuff is expensive like this is the like <laughs> what my little self my little 16 year old self or I just could not fathom I just could not fathom it like I didn't touch any I didn't want to touch anything the um, the sales associate was so nice to me and my mother um, they allowed me to like look at the different bags and see the different style that I wanted I was just like oh my gosh like I am up 
freaking obsess, like obsessed. And I and that's when I knew for sure I fell in love with ooh my speed my speedy kind of flat. Um, that is when I fell in love with the speedy the speedy thirty. And honestly, let me let me just tell you how the universe worked. I really wasn't trying to get the speedy 30. I was actually trying to get the monogram speedy 25. And I guess my excitement was just like flowing because my parents was just like, you know, you can get the bag that you want. Um, and I guess I accidentally said speedy 30. <laughs> and so that's how I ended up getting the speedy 30. Um, but yeah, I originally wanted the speedy 25, but I'm not complaining. I'm super happy and super blessed that I have this bag. And I just love this bag because my parents got it for me. It's always going to be something that's in my collection. Like I'm not giving this bag up and I am just so blessed and so happy and so that is why I chose this bag for my hashtag I love this bag the most because my parents mean the absolute most for me and they went out of their way and provided an, an amazing trip for me and gifted me this amazing bag and I'm just forever and always thankful so mom and dad if you're watching this video I am so thankful for you guys and everything that you have done for me because I truly truly love you guys so so much and if you like content like this please make sure to um, like this video subscribe to this channel and also make sure you follow me on Instagram at underscore simply Fosma underscore loves luxury and until next oh and also don't forget about the giveaway that I'm doing all the uh, giveaway details will be in the description box down below and until next time my loves I'll talk to you guys later bye